welcome to Yoga for Kids. I'm Ms. Margaret Rose from The Well at Church Health. We're so glad you're joining us today for our quick yoga session. So if you have a mat or a towel, go ahead and grab it. You don't have to have one to do class today, but you do need a little room to move around. All right, we are ready to get started. So if everyone could join me on their mat or towel and sit up straight and tall, put your hands in your lap, and then I want you to close your eyes. We're gonna start our class today by taking a few big deep breaths. So everyone breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. One more time in and out. Taking a few big deep breaths like that is a great way to get yourself settled and calm, whether you're about to do some physical activity like yoga or soccer, or even sitting down to do some homework. So for this class, I'm going to start leading us through this wonderful book called ABC Yoga. And so each session, I will do five poses. So today we'll be starting with letters A through E. And I will read the page, show it to you, and then I will demonstrate the pose as well. And I want you to follow them along. So let's get started. All right. So A, B, C, yoga. The first letter is A is for armadillo. Armadillo curls up quick. Stretch with us to learn this trick. And I want everyone to come up onto their hands and knees like this. And then you're going to slowly sink backwards onto your heels and stretch your hands out in front of you. Get a good stretch through your shoulders. You can rest your forehead on your mat and just sit here for a minute. Feel that good stretch in your shoulders. Maybe take a deep breath in and out. job everyone. Now we will sit up and the next letter is B for butterfly. Who's that fluttering by? Join your hands and feet and smile at the butterfly. So I want you to sit up tall and then you're going to put the bottoms of your feet together and hold on with your hands. So this is a good stretch for your legs and your hips. And I want you to try to keep your back straight too. We don't want to be all hunched up over um, feet. So that's why putting your hands on your feet helps you sit up straight. And you can flap your butterfly wings slowly, maybe faster. Maybe you can think what color butterfly you would like to be or that you see flying around. And I'd like to see a purple one with all different shades of purple. And feel this good stretch. All right, good job guys. So now we're moving on to the letter C. C is for crocodile. Crocodile lives by the shore. Plank with us and find out more. So for a plank, what you'll do, come up on your hands and knees again and then you'll put your elbows down like the number 11 in front of you and then stretch your feet out behind you and keep your eyes looking at the top of your mat. Keep your back straight. Pull your tummy into your spine. It's a good exercise for your um, tummy muscles, for your core. All right, good job, everyone. Now we're on to D is for dog. Woof, woof, let's get outdoors. Like Doggy and me face down on all fours. So this pose is called Downward Dog. What you'll do is you can come up on your hands and knees again. 
and then have your arms in front of you, tuck your toes under, and then push up like this. And you wanna put your heels down to the mat as much as you can. Maybe bend your knees like this. Get a good stretch. Push your hands in to the floor. Really good so you get a good stretch through your shoulders. All right. Now, last letter for this session is E is for elephant. Elephant likes a cool drink. Bend down forward and let your head sink. So we will come to a standing position. And then I want you to bend your knees just a little bit. I'll turn so you can see just a little bit, not much, and then fall forwards. Let your arms hang heavy like an elephant trunk swaying around. You can straighten your legs if that feels good. And then just keep your head hanging heavy down in front of you. And bend your legs one at a time. All right, and slowly come up. Great job, everyone. Let's come back to a seated position. And we will finish today um, with class how we started it with a few big deep breaths again. So I want everyone to sit up tall, rest your hands, close your eyes, and take a big deep breath in with me. And out. One more time in. And out. Last time in. And out. Taking deep breaths like that is a really great way to feel your body calm down. I felt my body calm down after a little bit of exercise. You just sit and breathe and it lets your heart slow down, gets your breathing back on track. If there's ever a time where you're feeling angry or sad or upset, just taking a break for a few seconds and closing your eyes and taking some deep breaths is a great way to help you calm yourself down. So I want you to remember that. If you're ever feeling upset or angry, just close your eyes, take a big deep breath in and out. Blow everything out. All right, thank you guys so much for joining us today. I hope you and your family had a great time learning um, hopefully some new poses and check back soon for our next five letters of ABC Yoga. Thanks, have a great day.